Okay, what's up, guys? Now, um, I'm pretty sure if you see... All right, so I was just trying to put my remote on my bed, and it just decided I don't want to be a remote anymore. I want to be a bird, and it flew out my hand. I don't know why it did that. That was weird, but anyways, I'm pretty sure everybody is... Um, they're seeing why Joe Button is uh, trending on Twitter. And I was like, what is this dude trending for? So I'm like, I'm hoping it's not the worst. You know, I'm hoping that everything is okay. So I click on his name. And um, I, seen, I seen why he was trending. And it's like, to just cut straight to it, Joe. This is like your second time in the past year <laughs> that you don't went off on somebody. And it's like, who remembers back before maybe, yeah, sometime last year, he was chasing those kids down talking about that he was going to kill them or something. Because I think they said that he makes bad music or something like that. I per Like me, I don't listen like to Joe Button heavily. The only song that I really listen to of his, and I'm pretty sure everybody knows that song is Pump It Up only song I really listened to of his but um I'm not gonna say that the man's music suck especially if I haven't even heard of all of it I don't even know if those kids have heard all of it but for you to chase down those kids we ain't even gonna get on that that was like that's old news today he went off on little Yachty for being happy I mean listen I I don't know maybe if you're in a tough spot you don't want to see other people's happiness but why why are you trying to like force this man to not be happy like i was reading some of the comments and some people were saying like oh he the reason why he's um yelling at him like that and telling him to, like don't be happy in the music industry because it's the music industry and things like the music industry will mess you up and me my i haven't like i'm not in the music industry like i've made a few songs here and there but I'm like, I'm I'm just not like heavily into the music industry. Like me, I'm like Lil Yachty. I'm just making music for fun, just to have fun and stuff. So I don't know. Like, I don't know how he's doing music. Like, I don't know. I'm thinking Joe Budden, maybe how it was for him. He think he's thinking that's gonna be the same thing for Lil Yachty. And it's like, dude, you can't think like everything that happened to you is going to happen to another person. And it's like that person, you and that person are two different people. You and that person came from two different neighborhoods, two different places, two different, like you guys got different parents, different family. You guys just had a different life altogether. So it's like for you to go off on this man for being happy. And it's like, like in Lil Yachty, what he was talking about, what he was saying, that should be so inspiring and motivating to anybody out there. This dude came from nothing and became something. I mean, he didn't come from nothing, of course. He came from something. But it's he's he's in a better position than he was back then, pretty much. So that's the good thing. And it's like, this dude could have very well been dead. This dude could have been homeless. He, his music would have never got out there. Like, he's actually doing something. So that's the good thing. Like, I don't really listen to Lil Yachty that much. There's like a few songs I like of Lil Yachty's. But um, I'm not going to be mad at the man for being happy. Like, if that's if that's what he truly feels, if he truly feels happiness, like, 24-7, every day. And I'm not saying, like, you know, oh, this is, well, it's like, that's not kind of sound like I was saying. But I mean, like, you know, you have, like, some moments where you're frustrated and things. I'm pretty sure Lil Yachty, there has been some moments when he's frustrated and stuff. But... If it's like the majority of your day, like, and this is how I try to be too. I don't try to like let things get to me and stuff at my worst or anything. Like I always try to be happy, make others around me laugh and all that stuff. And you know, I, that's, that's how I try to live life. I just try to live life by making other people happy. So that's like my happiness is seeing others happy and stuff, having fun with others. But um, I don't know, to get mad at somebody for like, or for somebody to get mad at me for doing that. And I'm like, really? That's the type of person they have no happiness in their life. And I don't know how Joe Button, his happiness level is at right now. I don't know where that's at. But it's like, it must have been, it must have been at a low point during that um Lil Yachty interview thing. Cause, or podcast, whatever it was. But um, yeah, I'm like, you Joe, why are you getting mad at dude for being happy? I don't understand that. Like, I, I really don't. Like, and 
if you let him tell it, he's probably not even mad. But it's like you were yelling at that guy like he was your son. Like <laughs> you did not want him. You don't want him to have like it's I don't know. Like you can't just be like shut down everybody in the music industry. I'm pretty sure there's like few there's like few good men in the music industry, few good women, few good anybody. They probably even got good cats, rats, dogs. What else? I don't know. They got something in the music industry, but it's like you can't pretty much what I'm saying is like you can't just be all like, oh, trust no one. I mean, that's kind of like how you have to live life a little bit, but it's like to like not trust your own happiness. I feel like that's what he was trying to say. Like, you know, this is just like a moment thing. Like, don't think it's going to last forever and stuff. It's like, dude, you don't know how this man's life is going to be like. This man could be having the most happiest days for the rest of his life, okay? And it's like, you can't get mad at him for that. Like, honestly, you can't, you can't do that. I mean, I mean, he did, but it's like, what's the point? Like, what's, what's the, why, why waste the energy? Waste the energy on something else. Like, there's so much going on in this world right now, and you're worried about another man's happiness. Like, I don't understand that. Like, we're, uh, World World 3 is getting ready to happen. <laughs> Donald Trump's wig is still in place. What else? Um, cats are evolving. Dogs just being dogs. So there ain't no point of bringing up dogs. Video games are getting more rigged and rigged every day. Like, <laughs> so <laughs> I'm just saying, like, don't worry about another person's happiness. Make your own happiness. And worry about yourself. That's that's all I'm saying in things. But anyways, um, yeah, I, uh, what, what do you guys think? What do you guys think? Do you think Joe was wrong? Do you think he was right? Like me, I just, I think he was wrong. Like he should have said what he was saying in a different way. Instead of like sounding like he was like coming off as getting mad at dude for being happy and things. Like he should have said it differently. And, you know, I don't know how I like me personally, like I just been like, you know, I would have probably asked him like, oh, I know there has to be like some stressful days, you know, like you got some days where you're not happy and things like there's something going on and stuff. And, you know, but um, if, if Lil Yachty would have answered no, I'm like, all right, that's that's good. I been like, you know, more power to you on that one. And then moved on to the next step. But it's like to get mad at him, be like debating with him over his happiness. Nah, can't. Nah, that's that's a no can do. All right. But anyways, like I said, let me know what you guys think in the comment sections. I will talk to you guys later. Thank you for watching. Hopefully you enjoyed the video. And if you're new, please like and subscribe and peace.